So for the last couple of years, I've done an annual blog on trends in development for individuals and businesses, and I'm just doing the research to pull that together now, and I'll be releasing that in January. But I thought it'd be good to give a bit of background to that. And the, the purpose is it really gives a roadmap for what to work on from development space. If you're a business looking for what traits to look for in people or for individuals, what businesses are really looking for. So here's a consolidated list from some of those main uh, surveys done. And this is a list of 10 personal skill traits that are kind of most sought after as we move out into 2018. In 10th place, self-motivated, somebody that is actually really self-motivated and a self-starter. And that makes sense when you look at this big shift away from micromanaged type of environments. People want you to be able to work by yourself and alone. And so the buzzword there might also be initiative. The second one being a positive attitude and demonstration of passion. Now, again, that makes sense to me. Skills are always trainable and teachable. Attitude is less so. That is a spark that people choose from within. And so that is an infectious part of culture. And that's why businesses look for it. Another buzzword there to highlight you've got that is to show you're energetic. Third one is adaptability. And that's kind of a no-brainer when you think about the speed of change now that things happen, the speed of change in tech or all sorts of things that we've got to be adaptable to be able to learn and adapt what we're doing. And so other buzzwords that demonstrate the same would be resilience or open-minded. Fourth one is work ethic, being uh, somebody that demonstrates personal efficiency. This is why productivity falls into this as well. If you can really streamline your efficiency, it is a razor's edge of skill set. Two buzzwords that go with that is being conscientious or dedicated. That's really what people kind of look for with that. The next one is critical thinking, which kind of sucks for some people because it's really about analysis. However, this is in the context balanced critical thinking, which is an ability to research, to look at your own past experiences, to use your imagination or hypothesize, and use resources at hand to do some analytics. And so analytical is a buzzword that goes with that. If it's not a natural gift, certainly one that people are looking for now with the volume of data that they look to mine from um, businesses to, to get ahead and innovate more. The next one is problem solving. And that's an ability to really make a stand for yourself and not have to be direct or told what to do. Nobody wants vanilla these days in a business. They want you to just work alone. It ties into that being self-motivated and a self-starter. And so the buzzword there would be decisive. I find the next one quite ironic because it's loyalty. For, and the reason I say that is because SME, smaller business size enterprise or family run ones do this very well, but there's a lot of companies, the bigger companies out there, at the end of the day, they still have a bottom line. If you're just a number or a figure, they maybe don't demonstrate the same loyalty in return, and yet they absolutely do expect it and want it. So, um, you know, an ability to demonstrate a track record and have people talk highly of you is a great thing. The next one surprised me a little bit. It's always this, and been every list for the last two or three years, that's honesty. No brainer, really, but to err as human, an ability to be honest and own your mistakes is something, though, they look for. A willingness to learn. Learning is lifelong, it is continual, and given the speed of change again, we've got to make sure we've got time on our calendars still where we are, willing to learn, upskill ourselves. And the final one, the big hitting one, communication skills or social skills. Now, again, I want to give this context. It's not the same as social media skills. In fact, 67% of senior execs highlight the fact they want to get their, their businesses and people talking live face-to-face -face or using really collaborative tools to allow that to happen because they believe that that face-to-face -face real communication is what is going to increase their productivity and efficiencies over, overall. And so a buzzword that goes with that is uh, really empathy as well, really listening to other people. So many people are abbreviated messages or scanning for kind of big themes and text messages versus fully listening. So that's a list, 10 most sought after personal skills moving into businesses and some buzzwords that goes with it. Um, this is just some of the background work. In January, I'll be releasing the full blog on a roadmap for development for both five kind of key themes to focus on and more additional things like this.